November 2024, Civil Engineering Licensure Examination Questions, Mathematics, Surveying, Transportation, Construction Engineering, Actual Definition of Terms. Arranged by Engineer Matt no Number 1. Which of the following is the minimum thickness of one layer of compacted granular sub-base? A. 10 B. 15 C. 20 D. 25 Answer. C. 15 Number 2. The driver's ability to see ahead is needed for safety and efficient operation of a vehicle on a highway. The designer should provide sight distance of sufficient length that drivers can control the operations of their vehicles to avoid striking an unexpected object on the traveled way. Which of the following aspects of sight distance is true? A. Sight distances needed for the passing of four lanes. B. The criteria for measuring for implementing those sight distance in design. C. Sight distances needed for stopping, which are applicable on all highways. D. Sight distances needed for decision for decision of simple factor. Answer. C. Sight distances needed for stopping, which are applicable on all highways. Number 3. All demolition operation of buildings. No person except the workers who directly engaged in the demolition shall enter a demolition area to within a distance equal to blank the height of the structure being demolished. A. 1.5 more of. B. 3 times. C. 1.5 times. D. 1.5 more of. Answer, C, 1.5 times. Number 4. A rubber of rubber-like composition used to fill and seal joint or opening either alone or in conjunction. A, adhesive. B, joint sealant. C, paint. D, insulation. Answer, B, joint sealant. Number 5. In a water supply system, once building is separated into two parts water supply tree. The first forms of a cold water supply tree. The second goes through a water heater and becomes a hot water supply tree. The trees are composed of vertical and horizontal pipes. What is the form used for vertical and horizontal supply pipes? A. Risers and branches, respectively. B. Connections and roughing ends, respectively. C. Roughing ends and connections, respectively. D. Branches and risers, respectively. Answer. D. Branches and risers, respectively. Number 6. Which of the following acts as a retarder of concrete? A. Lime. B. Calcium chloride. C. Gypsum. D. Sodium silicate. Answer, B, gypsum. Number seven, it is a type of hazard control that involves replacing a toxic or hazardous method of equipment with ones that are less harmful. A, substitution. B, personal protective equipment. C, engineering controls. D, administrative controls. Answer, A, substitution. Number 8. It is a 3D model-based tool that provides users with a digital representation of a facility's physical and functional characteristics. It is a shared knowledge resource for information about a facility forming a reliable basis for decisions during its life cycle. A. Building Information Modeling BIM B. Computer-Aided Design CAD C. Geographic Information System GIS D. Facility Management Software Answer A. Building Information Modeling BIM. Number 9. Operating cost is the sum of those expenses a contractor experiences by working on equipment on a project. 1. Repair cost. 2. Cost of replacing high wear parts. 3. Fuels and lubricants. 4. Tire cost. 5. Operator labor cost. 6. Storage. A. 1, 2, and 3. B, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. C, 1, 2, and 4. D, 1, 2, 3, 5, and 6. 
Answer CI23IV and 5. Number 10. It is a vertical pipe that carries fluids from one floor to another within a building. A. Downspout. B. Vent pipe. C. Riser. D. Drain pipe. Answer C. Riser. Number 11. Blank our industry determines specifications of performance, which describes the skills, knowledge, and attitudes required by a worker in the performance of a particular role in the workplace. A. Job description. B. Competency standards. C. Work standards. D. Performance reviews. Answer. B. Competency standards. Number 12. The surveying in which the curvature of the Earth is taken into consideration. A. Plane surveying. B. Topographic surveying. C. Geodetic surveying. D. Hydrographic surveying. Answer. C. Geodetic surveying. Number 13. Three randomly chosen cars of a particular model are subjected to sideswipe shallow angle collisions and the monetary damages are noted. Assuming that the monetary damages in this type of accident are normally distributed, a 95% T-based confidence interval mean with T equal to 4.303 for the I is found. Which of the following is a correct statement? A. The confidence interval is valid. B. The confidence interval is invalid because in P equal to 3 less than 10. C. The confidence interval is invalid because T equal to 3.182 should have been used. D. The confidence interval is invalid because with normality assumption, a Z-based confidence interval with Z equal to 1.96 should have been used. Answer. A. The confidence interval is valid. Number 14. This is a drawing of the facility as it would look to an observer directly above. A. Elevation drawing. B. Section drawing. C. Floor plan. D. Site plan. Answer. C. Floor plan. Number 15. Use as a functional powder coatings for appliances. Increasing resistance to corrosion of pipes. Harsh conditions and wear and tear. A. Zinc powder. B. Polyester powder. C. Epoxy. D. Polyurethane powder. Answer. C. Epoxy.